Yo yo, this is Dover Black Hat Gaming. I do RPG games like Elder Scrolls and Fallout and many more. Subscribe to see more and enjoy the video. Ugh, the smell here. Let's try to handle this quickly. There's no escape. You must help me find my Arvac. He doesn't deserve to be in a place like this. Arvac, my horse. We came to this horrible place together. We were attacked by monsters, so I told him to run. Please, he's such a loyal creature. And he's been running for so long. You have to save him. A place like this will change you. Arvac! Arvac! Where are you? Arvac, please come back! Come back! about some of the Daedric princes in the other part. Some of them remind me of the Lord of Chaos. Saved him. His soul is free. I can feel it. He's such a loyal beast. Here, I'll teach you how to call him to you. He'll help you get around this wretched place. But I'm sure he'd be much happier someplace sunnier. Goodbye, hero. Take good care of Arvac for me. It's such a good horse.
Mother? Mother! It can't be. Serana? Is it really you? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the like prophecy, David hasn't he? No, you've got it all wrong. We're here to stop him. To make everything right. Wait a moment. You've brought a stranger here? Have you lost your mind? No, you don't... You. Come forward. I would speak with you. So how has it come to pass that a vampire hunter is in the company of my daughter? It pains me to think you'd travel with Serana under the guise of her protector in an effort to hunt me down. Coming from one who murders vampires as a trade, I find it hard to believe your intentions are noble. Serana has sacrificed everything to prevent Harkon from completing the prophecy. I would have expected her to explain that to you. You think I'd have the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her Elder Scroll alone? The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. When I fled Castle Volgahar, I fled with two Elder Scrolls. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's bow. The second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. Like myself, Serana was a human once. We were devout followers of Lord Molig Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summoning day. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure-blooded vampire. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Serana, and why I've kept the other Elder Scroll as far from her as possible. If Harkon obtained Ariel's bow, and Serana's blood was used to taint the weapon, the tyranny of the sun would be complete. In his eyes, she'd be dying for the good of all vampires. And how exactly do you plan on stopping him? been listening to me? Like Serana, I'm a pure-blooded vampire. My presence on Tamriel is as much of a danger hero, as hers. You care nothing for Serana, oh, or Lord, our plight. Whether or not you've become one of us in order to survive the Soul Cairn, you're still a vampire hunter at heart. You're here because we're abominations in your mind. Evil creatures that need to be destroyed. Serana, this stranger aligns himself with those that would hunt you down and slay you like an animal. Yet I should entrust you to him. This stranger has done more for me in the brief time I've known him than you've done in centuries. How dare you! I gave up everything I cared about to protect you from that fanatic you call a father! Yes, he's a fanatic. He's changed. But he's still my father. Why can't you understand how that makes me feel? If you'd only open your eyes the moment your father discovers your role in the prophecy, that he needs your blood, you'll be in terrible danger. So to protect me, you decided to shut me away from everything I cared about. You never asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. You just expected me to follow you blindly. Both of you were obsessed with your own paths. Your motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you too. I want us to be a family again, but I don't know if we can ever have that. Maybe we don't deserve that kind of happiness. Maybe it isn't for us. 
But we have to stop him before he goes too far. And to do that, we need the Elder Scroll. I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. I didn't see. I've allowed my hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. If you want the Elder Scroll, it's yours. Your intentions are still somewhat unclear to me. But for Serana's sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. Yes. I've kept it safely secured here ever since I was imprisoned. Fortunately, you're in a position to breach the barrier that surrounds these ruins. You need to locate the tallest of the rocky spires that surround these ruins. At their bases, the barrier's energy is being drawn from unfortunate souls that have been exiled here. Destroy the keepers that are tending them, and it should bring the barrier down. One more word of warning. There's a dragon that calls itself Dernevere roaming the cairn. Be wary of him. The ideal masters have charged him with overseeing the keepers, and will undoubtedly intervene if you're perceived as a threat. Be careful, and keep my daughter safe. Still here. The sooner we get out of this place, the better. Relieved, I think. All those things have been building for a while. You have no idea how long I wanted to say that to her. Look, I loved my father, but when he found that prophecy, that became his life. Everything else, even me and my mother, we just became clutter. I was close with my mother. But she just kept feeding me her opinions of him, and eventually I started believing them. The moment we gave ourselves to Molik Ball, things got really icy between them. They were both drunk with power, and pulling in different directions. And then he found that prophecy, and... that was it. I was. Honestly, it took me up until now to figure out that my mother was really just as bad as he was. He was obsessed with power. She was obsessed with seeing him fail. It was just so... toxic. Maybe I could have seen this coming. We could all be better off now. I know that in my head... But I just can't help feeling bad about... the way things are. Sorry, I know you're trying to help. Thanks. Anyway, we should keep moving. they call Dragonborn. Then it is too late. The lie has already taken root in the hearts of men. Where'd you come from?
not that we have to go with that. Oh, we can the That's fine. You lost? My daughter's driving me crazy. So forgive me if Hello, I'm a Myrna. bit on edge. If I were you, I'd move right Let's through our backwards little... Oh, you you're can. a traveler. Not you must have so here. much to tell about the... ...world outside this boring town. I'm sorry, could you describe the smell? Like some horrible monster was turned inside out and then exploded. What did you do? It was a minor miscalculation. So this is winter. I've already corrected it. Perhaps the stories and rumors were true. This. This. Hello, my love. Items? What items? Let me see those. Hmm. So. I'm not sure how you managed it, but these are exactly what I need to start my next set of experiments. Wonderful! If that's what it would Well, at least allow me to reward you for your uncanny foresight. I have to remember. Ward first, then summon. This place makes me a little uneasy. It doesn't matter what I really believe. You've done what you've had to for yourself, not for mother. Hope everyone enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And hit the bell icon. See you all on the next video. Enjoy life. And stay game.